In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who, who art, art in heaven, heaven hallowed, hallowed be thy name. name. Thy, thy kingdom, kingdom come, thy, thy will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. We will glory in the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ, in whom is our salvation, our life, and resurrection. Let us pray. Assist us mercifully with your help, O Lord God of our salvation, that we may enter with joy upon the contemplation of those mighty acts, whereby you have given us life and immortality, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Twelfth Station Jesus dies on the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. This is from the Gospel of Luke. It was now about the sixth hour and the sun's light failed so that darkness came over the whole land until the ninth hour. The veil of the sanctuary was torn right down the middle. And Jesus cried out in a loud voice saying, Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. With these words he breathed his last. When the centurion saw what had taken place, he gave praise to God and said, Truly, this was an upright man. Christ for us became obedient unto death. Even death on a cross. The reading says, Truly, this was an upright man. And he said this, the centurion, after darkness came over the whole land until the ninth hour. Uh, has darkness come over our whole land in 2022. In many ways, it feels like it. Um, there, there are a number of people uh, taking sides on social media right now over what happened at the Oscar performances. Uh, a comedian made a d joke about somebody's bald head that her husband found disparaging and her husband w went up on stage on live television and in front of a group of people and slapped this man. Uh, do we look at that and say truly this was upright? And people are saying well the comedian was okay and correct. No, the actor was um, correct. Uh, you know, it, when is violence correct? And so then it's very easy to con convict Will Smith and condemn Will Smith because he engaged in physical violence. Um, but is mean-hearted humor uh, at the expense of someone's dignity not also violent? And how do we dispel the darkness that seems to uh, be pervading uh, this time? Well, maybe we follow the example of Jesus and say, Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. And uh, maybe we turn our hearts over to Christ so that we can be in the heart of Christ uh, as he dies on the cross and says, Father, forgive them for they know not what they do. Uh, perhaps if we lived in a world like that, where we forgave rather than condemned, uh, there would be no darkness and messiahs wouldn't need to die on crosses for our sakes or because of our sins. 
Let us pray. O God, who for our redemption gave your only begotten Son to death on the cross and by his glorious resurrection delivered us from the power of our enemy, grant us so to die daily to sin that we may evermore live with him in the joy of his resurrection, who lives and reigns now and forever. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. Savior of the world, by your cross and precious blood, you have redeemed us. Save us and help us, we humbly beseech you, O Lord. Let us pray. We thank you, Heavenly Father, that you have delivered us from the dominion of sin and death and brought us into the kingdom of your Son. And we pray that as by his death he has recalled us to life, so by his love he may raise us to eternal joys, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. To Christ our Lord who loves us and washed us in his own blood and made us a kingdom of priests to serve his God and Father, to him be glory and dominion forever and ever. Amen. Peace. 